Welcome to Dr. Yat Van Ha's Problem Box. In today's lesson, we are going to solve a problem. Let's see what problem we have for today. Today's problem is about cupcakes. Cupcakes are sold in boxes of three and boxes of five. The question is, is it possible to buy 10 cupcakes, 9 cupcakes, 8 cupcakes, 7 cupcakes, and so on? The question is, is it possible to buy any number of cupcakes? Given that, Cupcakes are sold in boxes of three and boxes of five. Can we buy an exact number of cupcakes with no leftovers? That's our problem for today. Have you managed to solve the problem for those six numbers? How far are you in trying to figure out if it is possible to buy exactly a certain number of cupcakes? Are all numbers possible? Let's see. Clearly, we can buy many boxes of three cupcakes. So, 3 is possible, 6 is possible, 9 is possible, 12 is possible, 15 is possible, and so on. Did you notice something about numbers that are possible? That's right. Those are numbers in a 3 times table. Some of us know those are multiples of 3. So multiples of 3 are possible. 5 is possible, so are 10, 15, 20, 25, and so on. You are right. Numbers in the 5 times table are possible. Multiples of 5 are possible. So, 9 is possible, 12 is possible, because they are multiples of 3. 10 is possible, because it is a multiple of 5. How about 8? Is 8 possible? Of course it is possible. A box of three and a box of five. How about 16? Is 16 also possible? How about 24? How about 32? How about 40? Are those possible? How about 11? How can we get 11 cupcakes? Two of this and one of that, six and five, give us 11. So 11 is possible. How about 13? Is 13 possible? Two of that 
and one of this. Ten and three give us thirteen. Why don't you go ahead and try to figure out if any number is always possible for us to buy. Given that cupcakes are sold in boxes of three and boxes of five, is it possible to buy exactly any number of cupcakes? Are there some numbers that are not possible? What's the answer? What numbers are possible and what numbers are not possible? Of course, the numbers got to be whole numbers. And it is quite easy to see that numbers less than three, like one and two, are not possible. And numbers between three and five, in this case, four, is also not possible. What are possible? Multiples of three. Multiples of five. It is possible and all the multiples of eight is eleven possible two threes and a five is thirteen possible two fives and a three Is 14 possible? 14 is 6 and 8. We can get 6. From 2 3s, we can get 8. From a 3 and a 5. So 14 is possible. Is 17 possible? 11 is possible. 6 is possible. So 17 must be possible. How about 19? Is 19 possible? Yes, it is. So it seems like beyond a certain number, it is always possible. When cupcakes are sold in boxes of three, and boxes of five, we can buy eight cupcakes, nine cupcakes, ten cupcakes, and so on. But seven is not possible. So any number greater than seven, in other words, eight, or greater is always possible, it seems. If you find today's problem easy, why don't you challenge yourself? One way to challenge ourselves is to prove what we have discovered. In this problem involving three and five, we found out that seven was the last number. That's not possible. Eight, nine, ten, and so on. They seem to be always possible. If you find today's problem easy, 
you can challenge yourself by giving a proof that any numbers, whole numbers, greater or equal to 8 is always possible when the two numbers we have are 3 and 5. Another way to challenge ourselves is to ask what if the numbers are not 3 and 5. With 3 and 5, the last whole number that was not possible is 7. 8 and greater they are always possible. What if we have 3 and 7? What would be the last number that is not possible? After which, it is always possible to make exactly that number using 3 and 7. I think there's an interesting pattern connecting that number, the last number that is not possible, with the two numbers that we choose. Why don't you try numbers like 3 and 5, 3 and 7, 2 and 3, 2 and 5, 5 and 7, and so on but you can start with those suggestions. See you next time in another Problem Box. I can't forget the day we met Your eyes so blue, me piercing through I can't forget the day we met Your smile so bright